What if I told you that the most powerful antioxidant has been hiding in the Mediterranean kitchen for thousands of years, while the pharmaceuticals race to develop breakthrough supplements, this substance, this compound, I should say, hydroxytyrosol is virtually outperforming every single antioxidant in all the scientific testing. So today we're going to be talking about hydroxytyrosol. We're going to be talking about what it is. We're going to be talking about where it comes from. And we're going to be talking about why the European Health Authority have done something very rare. They have given an official health claim to this compound as the result of rigorous scientific evidence. Welcome back to the world of Papa Vince and my name is Bettina and I am very passionate about wellness and specifically evidence-based nutrition and I know that you are gonna la love today's episode. Hydrocytorosol is just not another trend or another health bath, bath word, no. Hydrocytorosol is actually a natural substance that is found in significant amount in extra virgin olive oil. And what makes it rare is just what I said, that it's a natural substance that actually supports wellness that is backed up by robust scientific evidence rather than marketing hype. In fact, the European Food Safety Authority, which is one of the most stringent regulatory bodies in the world, did something very rare. They actually authorized a health claim for olive oils and polyphenols including hydroxytyrosol. And believe me, they don't hand those out easily. So what is hydroxytyrosol? Well, think of it like a superhero with extraordinary capabilities. Hydroxytyrosol is what scientists call a phenolic alcohol, a small, agile, organic molecule with extraordinary remarkable capabilities and in reality from the chemical point of view is composed of a benzene ring with two hydroxyls attached to it. These two hydroxyl groups they act like a shield and they neutralize harmful free radicals. That's right, I mean hydroxytyrosol in scientific tests has shown to have higher antioxidant capabilities than most known antioxidants, including vitamin E and vitamin C. But this is what's fascinating. Hydroxytyrosol is not produced in, in a laboratory. Mm -mm. It's produced during the ripening of the olives, correct? Oleoparin, that is the molecule, that's the compound that gives olive the bitter taste. As that compound breaks down, it produces hydroxytyrosol. Essentially, is the olive building protection system that helps olive tree withstand harsh Mediterranean conditions like intense sun, drought, and other environmental stressors. And now is when things get even more interesting. In 2012, after reviewing more than 48 research papers and multiple human studies, the European Food 
safety authority authorize a health claim. A health claim saying that olive, olive oil polyphenols actually contribute to the protection of blood lipids from oxidative stress. What makes this remarkable is how rare is for the EFSA to make such claims. Their process is very thorough. It requires substantial scientific evidence and clear demonstration of cause and effect. Now, this regulation includes precise requirements that olive oil must contain at least 5 mg of hydroxytarsal in 20 grams of olive oil. And I'm gonna tell you one thing, this isn't just marketing, this is official recognition but with governmental verification and scientific consensus. So where can you find hydrocytarosol? Well, while hydrocytarosol is available in several parts of the olive tree, extra virgin olive oil remains the main or only significantly dietary source that actually provides hydrocytarosol in a natural and bioavailable form. But here is the thing, not all olive oils are created equal. There are several factors that determine the hydrocytarosol levels. Early harvest olives contain a significant higher amount of hydrocytarosol than those that are fully ripe. However, early harvest means sm a smaller yield and increase in cost, but it yields a significant higher amount of these beneficial compounds. Second, the extraction method is very important. Why? Because hydrocytarosol is soluble both in water and oil. Traditional methods use water, but unfortunately, that means that the soluble part of hydrocytarosol will be lost. That's when the waterless extraction becomes important. Only top-notch facilities in Italy actually use a system that doesn't need water and is able to preserve in this way the water-soluble and fat-soluble part of hydrocytarosol. Third, the variety, Nocellara del Bellici, which is a variety that naturally grows in Sicily, contains higher amount of, poly of uh, hydrocytarosol than other olive varieties. And finally, you need verification. Look for an olive oil that provides lab tests that not only show the polyphenol levels, but show the hydroxytarosol levels. Now, let's talk about what happens when you consume hydrocytarosol. And this is when things get really fascinating. When you take one tablespoon of high quality extra virgin olive oil, your body tends to absorb between 40 to 95% of hydrocytarosol. This is remarkable when you compare this to other polyphenols where you can barely get a 10% absorption rate. And what makes this possible is the dual solubility of hydrocytarosol. That's right, it dissolves in water, it dissolves in oil, making it easier for your body to absorb. And this is why the Italians have spent hours 
and millions of dollars developing an extraction machine that actually doesn't need water so that they can keep this precious substance in their olive oil. Again, this waterless extraction is key because it keeps uh, the, the water soluble portion and the fat soluble portion of hydroxytyrosol. That way your body can get the full benefit of this remarkable compound. Again, this dual nature of hydroxytyrosol allows to travel it effectively through all the environments in your body. Something that a pure water soluble or a pure fat soluble compound may not be able to do as effectively. But hydroxytyrosol does more than just neutralizing free radicals. It does something awesome. Research suggests that it actually activates your body defense system. Yes, your natural body defense system through a pathway that the scientists call the NRF2 pathway. In other words, is your body's master regulatory of antioxidants response. Studies suggest that this creates what scientists call a cellular memory effect. In other words, when, high, when a cell is exposed to hydroxytyrosol, for some reason, it activates and it enters an enhanced protective activity for extended periods of time. Okay, now let's talk about hydroxytyrosol potential. Now, remember, all the research that we're going to mention right now makes a connection between the ingredient and a structure function. There is no health claims connections. So let's mention the first one. The first one is the European Food Safety Authority actually approved a claim that is connected to cardiovascular support, which basically says that olive oil polyphenols contribute to protect blood lipids from oxidative stress. But emerging research is also exploring other fascinating areas like bone health support. It seems that hydroxytyrosol enhances osteoblast and inhibits osteoclast. Also, research from the second university of Naples uh, is expanding on the fact that hydroxytyrosol may support health, glucose, metabolism, and helps maintain uh, mitochondrial function. And remember, the mitochondrials are those powerful plants where nutrients are converted into energy. Some research even suggests that hydroxytyrosol may cross the brain barrier, Woo! which means that it actually supports neurological tissues. But remember, these are all areas that are being explored by the scientific community and there is no really any health claims. And this is how it gets practical. When you have bottles of extra virgin olive oil ranging from $20 to $90, how do you know which one has the quality you need? First, look for laboratory verification. Quality producers will provide you with a certificate that shows not only the total amount of polyphenols, but the exact amount of hydroxytyrosol. The European Food Safety Authority requires at least 250 total polyphenols. Second, check for the harvest day. The newer the extra virgin olive oil, the higher the amount of polyphenols. Third, production methods matter. Early harvest and waterless extraction may make the olive oil a little more expensive, but it will have a higher amount of those beneficial, beneficial compounds. 
And here is a sensory tip, that peppery kick that you feel in the back of your throat when you are actually using or tasting good quality extra virgin olive oil. That's the result of oleacanthal. And this is a polyphenol that appears alongside hydroxytarosol. And don't fall for polyphenol inflation. Dramatic claims without verification. True high quality olive oil with very fine amounts of hydroxytarosol represents higher quality than any supplement. So how do you incorporate this into your daily routine? Well, according to the European Food Safety Authority, you only need to consume about 20 grams of good quality extra virgin olive oil, which is about 1.5 tablespoon daily. This integrates really easy into your daily life. All you have to do is use it in salads as a salad dressing, drizzle on all your foods, you know, on your soups, on your spaghettis, on your chicken. Good quality extra virgin olive oil just delivers amazing flavor. Consistency matters more than occasionally larger amounts. And here I have great news for cooking enthusiasts. Extra virgin olive oil actually retains a significant amount of hydroxytarosol activity even with moderate heat cooking. The compound is more stable than most people realize. In conclusion, hydroxytarosol represents the perfect marriage between ancient, wis ancient wisdom and modern science. I mean, for thousands of years, extra virgin olive oil has been valued by the, by the Mediterranean cultures, not knowing exactly why. But now, modern science is, is starting to discover the key reasons why. When you choose a high quality extra virgin olive oil that has a verified lab test, you are not only connecting with this tradition, but it's a tradition now that is grounded in scientific evidence. What's your experience with high quality extra virgin olive oil? Have you noticed that beautiful peppery kick in the back of your throat when it comes in contact with it? Let me know in the comments below. If you like this video, remember to click in the like button and to subscribe to our channel to get more nutrient based content. And if you're interested in the scientific reference, make sure to click the link to our blog in the description section. Until next time, here's to your health.